So to solve this, we need to work out the areas of the colours. Now, first of all, the area of the whole target is pi times 25 squared, which is 625 pi. The area of the red bit is pi times 10 squared, which is 100 pi. The area of the green bit is pi times 15 squared. Take away the area of the red bit, which is 125 pi. The area of the brown bit is equal to pi times 20 squared. Take away the green bit, take away the red bit, which gives 175 pi. And finally, the area of the blue bit is 625 pi. Take away the brown bit, take away the green, take away the red, which gives you 225 pi. So now the expected score depends on the areas of the colours and how many points you get for each colour. So the expected score E equals 100 pi, that's if he hits the red over 625 pi times 10 points, add 125 pi, that's if he hits the green over 625 pi times 7 points, add 175 pi over 625 pi times 5, that's if he hits the brown, add 225 pi over 625 pi times one point only if he hits the blue. Simplifying this, we get 40 over 25, add 35 over 25, add 35 over 25, add 9 over 25, which equals 119 over 25, which is 4.76. So his expected score is D, 4.76.